Holmes All-Star Promotions is proud to present four rounds of boxing in the featherweight division. This bout is sponsored in part by Redlands Ford. Once again, our referee in charge of this bout, Raul Kais Sr. And now, introducing to you first on my right, fighting out of the blue corner, he is wearing white shorts, to ribbed in gold. He is training out of YPI Boxing Club in the San Fernando Valley. He weighed in 127 pounds. His record, three wins, three losses, one draw, with one win coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Christian Silva. This is gonna be a good fight. His opponent, across the ring on my left, Fighting out of the red corner, he is wearing black trunks trimmed in silver. He is representing La Habra Maciel Boxing Club by way of Juana La Habra. He weighed in 127 pounds. His record, four wins, three losses, one draw, with one win coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Ricardo Kiki. Garcia! Once again, our company of the Kaiser Senior to give final instructions. Well, there you have it. We got a good fight in one of the main events of the evening here. Here we go. Ed Holmes, Battle of the Rising Stars. We sort of talked about these guys a little before the fight. Anything you know or would like to add to, about them here this evening? Well, Christian, I've done all, actually, I've done all his fights. Even this one, uh, he's tough, very am limited amateur uh, fight, but he's game. Uh, Ricardo, he's, he's, I did a couple of his fights too, he's pretty slick. Well, they both have about the same amount of fights under their belt. Ricardo 4-3-1, yes. Christian 3-3-1. Three, three both with a knockout, so seemingly pretty evenly matched. Yes. Both guys putting their heads into the pocket and, and, and making nice moves, good good uh, punches, throwing good punches. Uppers. Boy, Silva's a pretty, ooh, look at that, pretty quick. Silva, very quick fighter. He's got a very quick left-hand jab. You can see there Garcia threw two or three punches, and, and uh, Silva able to dodge and move away from every one of them. It looks here like Garcia may have a slight height reach advantage, but not, not much. Ricardo pounding, continuing to sort of jab and come in hard. Yeah. Jab, 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 jab. Silva doing a nice job of fighting off that attack. It seems that Garcia is, is sort of forcing the action, coming in, coming in, throwing the punches, but Silva doing a really good job of fighting it off and, and, and getting in some shots on, on his own. And now Garcia's back on the ropes a little, kind of. Silva's starting to press the action. Ten seconds left in round one. Again, a lot of punch being punches being thrown by Garcia. 
A lot of them not landing, however. Silva doing a nice job of, of defending, I would say, maybe more than anything. What do you think? I agree. I agree. Ricardo throwing a lot more punches, but there's nothing landing. I don't yeah. know how. Of course, we got the all-star promotion ring girls out here tonight doing a fantastic job, as always. Yeah. Certainly uh, appreciate their input. They certainly look better than you and I would up there doing that. Yeah, they do. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, it, it's, it's always a, a good show here at Val the Rising Stars. And... Uh, yeah. It looks like we got another great fight on our hands as we move into the second round. And that was that was a pretty impressive first round, really, from both fighters, I think. Yes, uh, yes. We're going to be going four rounds of boxing in this one tonight, folks. There goes Silva getting a little more on the offensive now, tucking his head in a little more and, and maybe a little less on the defensive. That left actually landed for Silva. Looks like Silva coming out a little more of the aggressor here in round two. Scott Garcia back in the corner a yeah, little a bit here, fight. but he's not throwing nothing on his punches, but Garcia working off the ropes a little bit, trying to yeah. keep Silva off. Well, Garcia can throw some punches. I think uh, Silva's doing a great job of, of not really letting him yeah. connect, but if he does, Silva could be in a little trouble. Yeah, I think maybe you're right. Silva was in position there, but not much power behind the punch. He needs to maybe get his feet into position and, and sort of punch forward yeah. rather than off balance. Nice jab there from Garcia. There, that time Silva kept his head in it, maybe got a, a little better punch contact that time. Ricardo seeming a little more on the defensive this round. Yeah. Christian's right in his face. Yeah, Silva connected a couple in that exchange. I saw at least one or two left. Nice jab by Garcia off the ropes. Garcia with a nice right hand to the body. Ooh, and here comes Silva with a couple of nice punches on Garcia. The fighters kind of coming into their into their rhythm now with 10 seconds in round two. Nice inside exchange. And we're going to wind down that second round with with I think the fighters sort of coming into their style now of how yes, they're going to approach yes, the fight. Yes. yes. Any changes that you, you saw? It seemed like Silva really changed his technique in that second round. Silva did good this round. Just got to stay more busy. Well, and I suppose, you know, when you're throwing a punch, the power is going gonna, is gonna to come down to your stability on the ground, right? Yes. If you're not stable with your balance, the, the punch doesn't have much behind it, right? Right. He's got to be stable, pan his feet, and land. Right. If you're on one foot and off balance and throw something, it's not going to have much much impact. So it seemed like at the end of that round, he, his punches got a little more effective. We'll see if that continues in round three. Close fight. Yeah, it, it, it is another great, great matchup. Yes. 
I was wrong about Pete Hiranaka. I, he does know what he's doing, I guess. <laughs> Here we go, round three, Battle of the Rising Stars. We got Silva Garcia in a tough battle. Very evenly matched evenly fighters. Evenly matched. Effective exchange there for both fighters, landing a few each. Silva coming out even even more as the aggressor in round three. Wow, he's coming out like a bull. Garcia now with Silva in the ropes a little bit, trying to get something going, but but. Silva doing a nice job, looks like, of, of punching off of the ropes. Yeah, he's, he's doing it. He hurt him. Well, here we go. We're only got four rounds to go, and in round three, we're starting to see some damage. Silva coming in nice on Garcia again, lands a couple of nice combinations. And, and maybe for the first time in the fight, Silva, I think, in the lead in this round. Oh. Silva, nice right uppercut, connects. Silva tries to come in with a hard right. Ooh, another hard right's coming in from Silva Garcia, working off the ropes, trying to fight it off. Silva forcing and pressing the action now pretty much Dictating the, the pace. Silva, nice, nice move there. Connects with another left. And I think I think Silva's starting to have a little impact on Garcia. Yeah, he's coming along. Good, good evening, man. Yeah, it, it seems like, you know, I think, you know, in round one, Garcia came out, you know, he kind of controlled the, the action a little bit, kind of, you know, with more of a fundamental approach. But now that we're gearing up to round four, I, again, we've got a, a kind of a tough one to call. I, I think I have to give that round to Silva. Yeah. So if that's the case, not that we've been Accurate mushroom. <laughs> no, we've been pretty good tonight. <laughs> I guess that's true. Not too bad. But you never know. But uh, if that's the case, it's 1-1 one, one and a tie. So here we go again. Comes down to round four. Comes down to round four again. I think Silva can win this fight if he's able to continue doing what he's doing and maybe get lucky and, and maybe do, you know, you know, hurt Garcia a little bit. Yeah, he's got to bring it. I think Garcia in round four needs to throw a few more punches. And Silva coming in, coming in. Garcia sort of dodging, but Silva looks like he's coming in with the same. It seems Silva's almost has, is not letting Garcia get into his rhythm. No, he's just breaking it up. See, just. Garcia not backing down, though, doing a good job keeping his head in there. Yeah, he's right in there.
two minutes in round four. Probably these two minutes could decide this fight. We're down to the last two minutes. Well, both fighters are scoring, but again, Silva pressing the action, pushing is just a little harder. Ooh, right hand almost really connects on Garcia, but not quite. And Garcia was backing it up just enough to not really feel the punch. Ricardo Garcia's corner now getting a little sense of urgency yeah. over here. I don't know if you want to leave this one up to the judges. You better uh, do yeah. something. He's got, he's got to bring it. Look at that. Silva lands a couple of jabs, and then Garcia landing a couple body shots coming back. Down to 30 seconds here, round four, and it's going to be uh, Garcia. He's going to need to try to. These guys are Silva just won't go away. He just won't let up. And here we go, folks. Good fight, good fight, good fight, good fight. Fantastic good fight. Good fight, good fight, good fight. Good fight. Good fight. Good fight. Good fight. Very good fight. Both fighters uh, sticking to it and, and exchanging blows pretty much. Yes, good fight. Hard to tell from the reactions of, of, of either what they, they both think they won <laughs> as usual. And I, I, that fight. one's a tough one. That, that last round, I think, very close. Very close. Who do you got to know to get one of those leather jackets? I asked for Ed. Uh, I want one of those. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think we, all, we all want one. Well, what do you think about the fight? Well, these guys are about as evenly matched toe to toe as maybe we've seen all night. There's there's not much differences in their styles. Um, Silva just seems a little more in there, a little more in the pocket. Um, but again, you know, sometimes the emotional side of what you see doesn't always add up to the point side. Yeah, I th good. It's a good fight. I mean, I, I, you know, at the same time, I can't say that Garcia did a bad job. I think he definitely won the first round. Yeah, he and, won that. and then it, it got close after that. So uh, we saw that earlier in the first fight. Um, it was a really strong first round, and, and that kind of held up, even though it had a tight finish. So you know, it could be the same sort of type of thing here tonight. Wow. He he was he was hoping he won, but he said I don't think he did. This one was hard to tell. It was it was they were toe to toe Ladies most of the time. After four rounds of action, we go to the scorecards. We have our decision. Judge at ringside, Sharon Sands scores about thirty-eight to thirty-eight a draw. Although she was overruled by both judges ringside, Jonathan Davis and Zachary Young, who both scored the bout 39 to 37 in favor of our winner. By majority decision, Christian Silva. Well, that was good. He actually, uh, well, again, that was very reminiscent of our first fight of the evening. I believe wow. in, in the first bout of the evening, they had they had a draw by the first judge and then overruled. Hey, fight fans, can I have your attention, please? Good, good fight. Whoa, whoa.